we, we have some sense of how much population might grow in, in the decades ahead. But rising affluence um, has a huge effect on the amount of grain we consume. For example, in India, the average consumption of grain per person per year is about 400 pounds. So they have about a pound a day to work with. When you have only a pound of grain per day, you can't afford to convert much of that into animal protein. You have to consume almost all of it just to sort of keep body and soul together. In this country, by contrast, we consume about 1,600 pounds of grain per person per year. Of that, we consume only maybe a couple hundred pounds directly, bread, breakfast cereals, and so forth. Uh, the bulk of it we consume in the form of livestock products, meat, milk, and eggs. And just to give you a sense of how much grain it takes, um, uh, a pound of uh, additional live weight in the feedlot for a steer takes at least seven pounds of grain. A pound of additional weight for a pig, about four pounds of grain. For chickens, it's about two pounds of of grain per pound of um, additional live weight. So once you start moving up the food chain, consuming more grain-intensive livestock products, demand for grain expands a lot. And what we have in the world today is we estimate something like three billion people now wanting to move up the food chain at the same time. A big chunk of those, of course, being in China.